uh, everybody asking about this oil price, oil thing, that how it go negative. Imagine this case study, imagine this, uh, this scenario, just imagine. Let's say you pay $500 today to get a prostitute after 15 days. To receive a prostitute after 15 days, you're paying $500 now because maybe your wife is going somewhere, she has some traveling plan. That's called the future contract. You're paying now to get the prostitute after 15 days. Now what happened, unfortunately, this Chinese coronavirus thing came in, everything is locked down, everything is messed up, and your wife is not going anywhere. Now, you don't want that woman to show up, okay? You don't want, you, you don't want her at any cost at your house, okay? So the first option you have is you're trying to sell this contract, this commitment, that $500 commitment to your friends but they have the same situation. They're also full of story. Their wives are there and you know everything is locked down. The second option you have is you're trying to sell that contract back to, back to the exchange from where you got it. But the worst thing, they're saying they are running you know, out of space and they are full of girls so they don't want to get it. Now, you have no other option. The only thing is now you are offering anyone who hold this, who get this woman on behalf of you you don't want $500, you're giving it for free, or maybe you wanna pay some amount to that guy who holds it, okay, who holds that woman for you. That's the thing, that's the whole story of oil, okay, that how it went negative.